I wish, honestly, Jerry, I wish so bad you would have watched um, Poor Things with me. I wish I didn't already start watching that. That weird movie. It was freaking weird, but it was also like good. I just got this awesome shipment in from Happy Hour. Um, I think that's what it's called. Is it Appy? Oh yeah, it's Appy, yeah, like uh, Appetizer. Yeah. Appy Hour box sent to me with specialty meat and cheese. And there's some biscuits and spread. I am so excited to make a little board. Perfect timing for the weekend. We have some yummy goodies in here. So I'm going to show you guys everything, but I'm gonna get it in the fridge right now and cool it down and then we'll show you guys once we're ready to assemble the board. We have Irish farmhouse cheese. We have Irish cheddar. We have, how do you say this? Let me see. Right here. This is all from Appy Hour. And then we have brie, yum. We have some walnuts. We have some dried cherries. And then we have salami and prosciutto. And then I'm gonna make a board. We have some biscuits, oat cake biscuits. These look good. So, oh, we have mustard with cheese. So I'm gonna make a plate for Joey and I. Um, this. Happy Hour sent me this box. Um, it's a uh, subscription. It's a subscription, or you can do a one-time order for the box. Um, they have different sizes, and it comes with meats, cheese, spreads, and a cracker. And it's for to make a charcuterie board. So I'll leave them linked for anyone who wants to um, place an order. I feel like this is perfect for date night, don't you, babe? Like just a little charcuterie board. We didn't have to go to the store and like get all this stuff. Like it just comes to the door. I have my cute little leaf charcuterie board I got from Home Goods. Oh, it's only got three episodes that are supposed to come out every week, but it's about the President Lincoln assassination and like the hunt. I swear, there's like no other genre that you like. <laughs> oh my god. I have this little cutting situation. I love these. We'll use some of this tonight. Okay, here's our beautiful board. We, it's okay. We're gonna watch a show and enjoy this. This one smells like wine. I'll leave the name on the screen. This one is in beer, porter beer. There's an Irish cheddar, a brie. Smoked prosciutto, salami. These two smell insanely good. I cannot wait to try. This car needs a good washing. We just got home. So earlier today we were at the baseball games, hence the baseball attire jersey. Um, but we went to the games. It was a really good game. And then we went through the car wash, got our car wash, um, and we came home and our dining room table is here. I'm so excited. The chairs are coming. They were supposed to be here Wednesday, but they're coming Monday it says. But the table arrived today and Joey is about to put it up. We also went to Aldi because we're gonna make a healthy, delicious dinner. I wish we had our chairs to sit on, but that's okay, they are coming. Um, the dining room table and chairs is actually from Costway, if you guys are familiar. Um, really, really cool place, similar to Wayfair, but a little bit different and more affordable. And they're of course giving me a coupon code for, for you guys, so I'll link that below. I'll show you the dining room table. 
I am so stoked for it. I'm just kind of pulling out some of the stuff I don't really need to show you, like energy drinks. <laughs> but we have, we love these sparkling um, frost pineapple coconuts. These are zero calories, no, they're five calories, zero points, um, no sugar, really, really yummy drink. So we like to always have those. We ran out of spray, so had to get some olive oil spray. And then I love this tuna. This is the solid white tuna and water. I'm gonna make some tuna salad and some chicken salad for meal prep. I'll show you, I'm so excited. So, so excited. We got black beans and corn. I'm gonna make a salad right now. I'll show you guys that salad. I'm gonna make like a Mexican style salad with um, some really, really good dip that we have. How's the color? Oh my gosh, I'm so I'm so excited. Cosmic crisp apples. We love these apples. Put some in the fridge. Mm, so good. Strawberries, because it's strawberry season here. Probably strawberry season in a lot of warmer places. We actually are so close to the strawberry festival, like 30 minutes away maybe. Uh, Not even, yeah, like 25. Yeah, like 20. We got some mint to go with the strawberries for me and some Cool Whip. That sounds so refreshing. But we aren't gonna go because the food is way too tempting for me. I'm gonna feel like crap and it's just so crowded. And yeah, neither neither of us are like into rides anymore. We don't yeah. drink. I do love a strawberry shortcake. I know. We don't need more than this has been the last Oh, this smells so good. Cilantro for the salad. You want cilantro on the salad, Joe? I love these wraps. These are the Aldi ones. They're called, instead of like carb counter, they're carb control. 60 calories, one point. I love making ham or turkey cheddar roll-ups or pepper jack. We actually got some pepper jack. And I just put the turkey in there or ham. Usually I'll do ham and cheddar or turkey and pepper jack. And I'll mic it and then cut it into roll-ups. Dip it in mustard, such a great lunch, you guys. So good. Um, and then I got some microwavable, <laughs> it's no secret, I suck at making rice. I'm so impatient with it and just never turns out good. Actually, that's that's not true. It, I've made good rice before, but I just don't like to do it. So microwavable, it is for me, jasmine rice. We got some chocolates, mini, mini chocolate chips. This is also for the strawberries, if we want like a sweet little chocolate dipped strawberry. Maybe I'll make this tonight, that sounds good. Oh, we got That's these. I, I love these. Where's my phone? Let me give you guys the points on this. Maybe I should make those strawberries around even in the freezer soon. Okay, so these are three pieces for four points and 80 calories. So the calories on it seem a little bit better than the points. But these look good. I'm gonna pop these in the freezer. You've got stuff all over you, sweet pea. We got the vacuum. That sounded so southern. Sweet pea. <laughs> got some coffee. Okay, so I was getting the Aldi brand coffee, and I really liked it the first few times I got it, but then this last time I got it, it was so weak. It was so bad. So I'm just not gonna buy it anymore. I don't know if like they watered it down or there's watery batches, but it was horrible. So stock it is. We got, ooh, are we making this tonight? Corned beef for St. Patrick's Day, which is tomorrow. So we're gonna make corned beef tonight and have that for leftovers. We're not gonna do potatoes. We're trying to keep it a little bit lower carb here. So we're just gonna do carrots and onion and cabbage, which I love cabbage. This meat is so delicious. You honestly don't, it, you don't need carbs because of veggies get soaked up by the juice so speaking of carbs I said we're going a little bit less carbs not completely taking carbs away so it's not for us but these are my favorite french fries they're so great so so great in points you can have a lot of them I think it's two ounces for five points or four it's really such a great these are like one of the best points I've found in fries they're the seasoned fries by Aldi and I air fry them and they're amazing Fat-free half and half, so great. Four tablespoons for one point. And I always can find fat-free half and half at Aldi. If you want to have really low point coffee, but creamy, that is something you should definitely try. We got pepper jack cheese. Pepper jack cheese, you know, I have a, 
Cheese in general is so high in points, you guys. But I, what I do is if I have cheese, I don't use mayo. Um, just because the creaminess comes from the cheese. Three sli uh, points for one slice. Not horrible. I got some frozen broccoli because we had broccoli last night. So I'm just getting more. Ham. And what else do we got over here? Oh, okay. So I've been loving roasted peppers. It is so good. I love it. So I've been roasting peppers for a lot of my meals, like chicken bowls, protein bowls. I'll add roast peppers, mushrooms. So, so good. Here's our cabbage. We're going to cut that up here pretty soon. And then last but not least, we have some chicken broth for the puppies. This is the fat-free lower sodium. I think it's lower sodium um, chicken broth. We always like to add a little bit of moisture to the dogs food and that is everything that we got it's a small grocery haul so i wanted to just show you guys that really quick i'm going to go ahead and put everything away make some lunch which i will bring you guys with me for that i'll show you a delicious salad option and i cannot wait joy is going to be down at the table hopefully pretty soon fingers crossed supposed to make yeah okay. did it come with a pepper yeah. no it didn't but i'm going to add some of this in it big of a salad because we're gonna eat dinner um it's gonna be so good and i want to be hungry <laughs> so nothing like too big i have some onion i have some lettuce i'm gonna mix it all into a bowl and then serve it we have some leftover meal prep chicken and i also grabbed some black bean and corn and i'm gonna plan to make these for lunch so I put some in containers so I could just easily, it can be easily accessible. Okay. And then I have some cilantro. I love cilantro so much. All right, you guys, I am making some granola for Joey. How much granola should I make? Uh, like that. I got some dried cherries going in, some walnuts. We're gonna put some hot honey, a little bit of sugar, and then the cinnamon toast crunch, which has sugar in it too. So I might just use that. Or do you want real sugar? No, I want a little bit of real sugar. Bit of sugar. Okay. Yeah, this is mainly for Joey, so. I can't deprive him completely of sugar. A lot, yeah. Well, this is better for sure than buying it in the store because you can control how much we put in. Because that granola in the store is so high in sugar, boy. We could probably put a little bit of stuff in it. Yeah, because then I can have it. Yeah, because we have some. Yeah, you ain't going to be able to tell no difference. Go oh, get that Splenda. Yeah, I think this granola is going to be really fun good. Mm -hmm. okay. Let's see how she turns out. I'm going to bake her for a while. Like, I don't even know. Actually, 25 minutes. We'll keep tossing her though. Keep checking on it. Don't let it burn too much. 
and toss it while it's in there. Okay, you guys. So this is my little trick for my sauce. We're doing this is smoky chipotle ranch dip. It's seriously so good. Joey got that at Publix because they're buying one free. And I'm gonna mix it with lime juice. This thins it out so that it makes more, therefore less points. Since we're splitting this with in two, I'm gonna do two tablespoons is four points, but we're gonna split it in half makes it two points. Yeah. So I do that a lot when I really love a dressing and I because I like a lot of sauce. I'm a saucy girl. So this is my trick for that. Okay. Give this a good mix. I also think it's just like I like thinner dressing too, and it's like to cover everything. So it really works. Everything's done. I'm gonna make our bowls here in a little bit. The granola is, has three minutes left. I need to get it nice, the granola hard. I already flipped it once. It wasn't where I wanted it, so put it back in for another 10 minutes. So that's a 30 minute total that we're doing this granola, and I think that'll be perfect. Okay, you guys, this looks burnt, but I promise it's not. It's just the syrup that is burnt on the edges. It turned out perfect. Like, do you hear that? I'm gonna let this cool a little bit more. It's cooling under a little rack. Then I'll pack it up in this glass container. Here's our salad. Looks phenomenal. This is actually pork. We thought it was chicken. We forgot we did one pork chop and I just put it in the air fryer and I got it super crispy. It is actually delicious. So good. We add some eggs, corn, beans, lettuce, tomatoes, onions. Here's the sauce. We're gonna sauce her up and have a nice salad and watch some TV and relax. After being in the sun at the game today, this is the perfect kind of into the day. Just getting prepped some stuff. That's scared. <laughs> Prep some things and making a good dinner. Got my table set up. I'm gonna show you guys in a second once Joey puts the old table away. We need to drink some water, bub. Who? Us. I got work. Oh. Me. Okay, guys. Look how stunning this color is. For one, she is the perfect size. She's 29 inches in height, 40 inches wide. And then we're going to have two beautiful chairs to go with it. And I know our floor is gray, but I just did not want gray and like very modern furniture. I wanted like a good mixture. I think that this brown brings out the painting. And then we have brown side tables, which this is all from the same place. My coffee table and my two side tables are from Cosway. I don't know if you can see. This is a two tier um, rattan and glass top. I just think it matches really good. It matches the brown in the painting and in the blankets. Like, that looks good. We're also gonna get a rug that's a little bit more neutral and browns. So that will help, and it needs the chairs for sure. But this is all from Cosway. So check them out. It was $139, which I think is excellent for a dining room table. It is so stinking cute. What do you think, Joe? Do you like it? I love it. You do? Yeah, it looks nice. Are you happy I went more old school? Yeah. Yeah, me too. It looks good. Thanks for putting it together. Okay, here's our salads. Yum. Oh my gosh. Looks so cute on the table. Like, that is just so gorgeous. Here's our salads. I did a little tortillas and cheese. Because this is actually the only thing we've eaten today besides an apple. <laughs> so, we are going to enjoy this delicious salad and watch our show. This looks so good. Yeah. All right, you guys, these chairs were a wee bit of a struggle, but Joey's here and he's about to finish it. Um, and I'm just putting these little Velcro, the little Velcro circles on the bottom.
Okay, you guys, Joey's in class, so I have to be kind of quiet. But this is the table and chairs. Stunning. I love it so much. I wanted something on the smaller side because, as you can see, it's going right in front of this wall. I didn't want it to come out. I didn't want it to be too big. I didn't want it to take up too much space and be too close to this furniture over here. I'm obsessed. I think this is so like more old school, vintage, dark, romantic. It pairs so well with this painting that I painted. I think it looks fantastic. The wood is absolutely gorgeous. And this is such an affordable table. Like it's so good in price. And on top of that, you guys can get a discount. And then these are the chairs I paired it with. I love these. It's like this really pretty purple, rich purple color. And then the little dots, like the little stitching dots, is kind of like a really gorgeous metallic gray plum. It is just so cute. Um, the wood matches perfect. I love the back. We sat on them. They felt good. They felt like they held up nice. I'm obsessed. I think it looks amazing in here now. So now we just need a rug that is literally like one of the, the things i'm struggling with the most is getting a really big rug for right here so eventually we'll get that and then i want to get a mirror and a lamp for right here and that's that's not really that important i really was waiting for the dining room table that's something that was bothering me um i could get two more chairs and store them for guests so that we could pull this out and have multiple chairs but for now i think just the two we really don't really have people over for dinner and things like that it's just usually just joey and i so i love it and then i got these beautiful flowers from publix and i just arranged them cut them down to size you like hey, baby. hi honey we're gonna make or i'm gonna make i'm gonna use your flower base Oh, shut up. Oh my god, Joey. That is not a flower vase. It's a flower vase. Joey thinks that this cup I got from Pier 1 is a flower vase. And, it, like, he's actually serious. He really thinks it was a flower vase. Um, well, it weighs, like, three pounds, so... It's just a really nice Pier 1 cup. No glass. That is a flower vase. A glass... Drinking glass has no business being this heavy, okay? He says it's like, I love this glass. Yeah. Joey, what do you think? It looks pretty. Isn't it cute? Good. I like it. I do, too. I'm gonna make a delicious dinner. It's our first night being able to sit at the dining room table. So we are gonna make our, I'm gonna make a mushroom sun-dried tomato chicken creamy pasta with panini. And then we're gonna have a salad to go with it. So that will be for dinner. I love my table. If you guys want this table or wanna shop all of Costway's home items, they're such a great company. I seriously love them so much. Everything I've been able to put together pretty much myself. My coffee tables are, that this coffee table is from them. My side tables are from Costway. And then now my dining room table and chairs. So I'll leave the link below along with a discount code for you guys if you wanna get some money off. Um, fast shipping too, they have really great shipping. Good customer service, all good things. So I'm gonna go ahead and also make a Bloody Mary and then go through the ball with the dogs and then I'm gonna get to, to dinner. Dinner is gonna be late tonight because Joey's in class and he might not get out until like 8.30 so whatever, we're just gonna have a late dinner. But it's gonna be delicious. So everybody should just know <laughs> That my wife is amazing. Oh, babe. We picked you know. out. So I love doing these screensavers, you guys. There's like a ton of different ones you can be at. Like you're a beachy. We did like rainy cafe, and yeah, then we like have our little cafe. our little red light on. So cute. Yeah, you just find those on YouTube. Yeah, and then our dinner on our new dining Look room table. Look at my wife. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. That's your wife. No, this is what you did. 